Welcome to the Stress-Free Naturally Podcast. Find your groove naturally with your host, Ashley Pappas. Hello and welcome to Stress-Free Naturally. My name is Ashley Pappas and I'm your host. In today's episode, we're going to be focusing on shiny object syndrome or the inability to really complete things. If you're anything like me, it's really easy to initially start on something because it's new and it's exciting and there's all of this potential. But after a little while, the excitement starts to wear off and it's actually work and not so exciting anymore and it might not be going along the time frame that you've set in your mind. And then we start looking for the next big thing or the next quick fix. And we jump boat on what we'd been focusing on and go over to the new ship where it's new and exciting just to repeat the cycle over and over. And this can cause people to really feel being stuck. It can cause frustration and overwhelm. And it's really common when we take on too much and there's not a system in place or habits in place for the changes to hold and to become really natural Or it's also caused by fear, sometimes choosing the wrong path or the wrong option and the uncertainty and second guessing ourselves like, okay, I chose to go to this college, but what if I was really meant to go to this one? Or this is something that I really struggled with growing up and I still contend to struggle with as an adult. But when I was in high school, I switched from one high school to another high school, back to that high school, and then again, all within the four years I was in high school. And so being able to commit to something and really having faith in the process and seeing it through can be very empowering. It can allow us to give the universe the time that it needs to really work its magic and to really allow what's meant for us to materialize in our lives. And so in today's meditation, we're going to really focus on keeping to the path and to seeing things through. And at the end of this meditation, if you stay tuned, I will be sharing with you yet another weird and random fact about me as I will be doing every week during the month of May. And so before we begin, find some place where you can be quiet and free from distraction for the duration of the meditation. Close your eyes. Take a deep breath in through your nose, allowing your breath to become slower and breathing all the way down to the very bottom of your belly. And as your lungs become full, slowly release the breath through your mouth, breathing at your own perfect pace. And as you breathe, gently allow each breath become a little bit slower and go a little bit deeper, feeling as your body becomes more relaxed, allowing each inhale to wash over your mind, allowing it to clear of any thoughts, any worries, anything that no longer serves you. exhale, allow yourself to let go of any stress, let go of any tension, feel as your muscles become looser, your mind becomes clearer, and you fall deeper into a state of relaxation with each and every breath, allowing your breath to become slower, breathing As you breathe out, letting go of anything that you no longer want to hold on to, 
let it go of any lingering thoughts, letting go of any tension, allowing your muscles to relax and loosen, and letting your mind fall into a state of peace. And as you continue to breathe, Allow yourself to visualize a bright, glowing light just off in the distance. And you feel drawn toward this light. And you feel the want and almost the need to come closer to it, to stand directly in front of it. And you feel compelled to move a little bit closer. you take a single step towards this light and then another and with each breath becoming more relaxed and more at peace you take another step closer to this bright glowing light and it seems far away but that's okay as you continue to move closer step, taking a breath, becoming one step closer to this light, seeing as it slowly becomes larger, you slowly notice that it becomes more vibrant, and as you continue to walk along this path, you notice that along the way, other lights glowing off to the side and even though you might be curious by them even though you might feel slightly drawn to one or another or even all of them you choose to continue on the path that you're on remembering what originally drew you towards the vibrant bright light off in the distance, allowing yourself to trust the process, continuing to breathe deeply and slowly, one step after another, understanding and accepting that if any of these other lights are meant to be in your life, if you're meant to stand in front of any of these other lights, then they'll be there later on, after you've made it already to the glowing, vibrant, white light up ahead. Having faith that you're on the right path, knowing that each step you take is perfect in that moment and exactly where you are meant to be. Allow 
allowing your body to rest and simply be in and gently wiggle your fingers and your toes bringing awareness back into your body and shrug your shoulders up and down waking them up and when you're ready open your eyes whenever you feel like you're being distracted from something that you've set out to do whether it be a personal professional or even just a soul driven goal You can revisit this meditation at any time. And if you found this meditation to be helpful, please leave a quick review on iTunes and share it with somebody else who you think it could help. And now for the weird random fact about me, Ashley Pappas. I've been in recovery from substance abuse for a while now, and I am coming up upon my six-year anniversary on Memorial Day. And so as a special treat, I am going to be releasing one episode each day between now and next Monday. Have a fantastic day. Namaste. This has been a Calm Clear Now Network production, executive producer Shell Hamilton. To discover more meditation, visualization, and affirmation podcasts like this one, visit calmclearnow.com.